Okay. I'm trying not to yell. <laughs> trying to be calmer. We have a new member to the community. I can't say her last name. Uh, it's Hannah Makasak. Hannah Makasak. Welcome to the neighborhood. Okay. That's really the only thing that I had to say. <laughs> now it's all about... Goodbye. <laughs> no! Now it's all about my question from yesterday. What was your question from yesterday? I'm about to say it. If you, if well, you let up. me come talk. On. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What does some... What? <laughs> you have no idea what your question from yesterday is. Yes, I do. In traffic. What is... When you're in traffic, what is something that somebody does that annoys you? Something, talk. Something like that. Talking. Talking. You can't talk to him when you're driving because he gets lost. What? Can't chew gum and walk at the same time. Jiminy crickets. All right, next time you're driving. You want me to... <laughs> talk about talking and driving. <laughs> you want me to drive? Go ahead. We won't get, we won't get to where we're going. Complaining about my driving. I'm not complaining about your driving. Go ahead, go ahead. No, stop making me laugh. Okay, so we had a lot of different answers. Um, we had tailgating or tailgaters, uh, Angie Lupus Live, YouTube Guy, 1985, turning single signals, people not using their turning signals oh, to that. tell everybody where else they're going. Tanya Longley, Gaga's Little Monster, who just got her license, by the way, and Crimson Fairy. Stomping on brakes, going 65 miles an hour down the road, and all of a sudden, everybody stomps on their brakes. Yeah. You know, no warning whatsoever, just stomp on your brakes and come to a complete stop, and you, you just about nearly hit them. Mom's Vlog 80 says that one. Okay. Destiny Swan is... The one thing she hates is people pulling out in front of her when she, when she, and blah, 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 blah. Destiny Swan. Got it. She hates when people pull out in front of her and then go super duper slow. Or when they pass her and then pull in front of her and then go slow. It's like, why did you pass me and then go slower than me? I agree. That used to irritate me a lot. I don't drive anymore, by the way, guys, but I used to drive. And those things, yes, used to irritate me so much. Um, Bambi S. I think what she was, what she's saying is when there's traffic and you're getting onto the freeway and you're trying to merge and people don't let you merge. It's like, um, I have nowhere else to go, so you need to let me merge. Or if there's a lane that's closed down and you have to merge into the traffic, um, they got to let you merge. <laughs> you have nowhere else to go, you know. And people are like bumper to bumper just so that you can't get in. I don't know if this is everywhere, but this is definitely California. Um, so Bella Luna, she hates it when she's driving down the road and there's no cars behind her and somebody pulls out and cuts her off. Why not wait 10 seconds for her to pass and then pull out? Sure. Why have to cut her off? Yeah, very frustrating. Very frustrating. And then, Dougie Style, his is that I hate when people don't get in the right-hand lane when they make the, tur the right turn. That they kind of sit in the lane and wait to make the turn. So that people that are going straight in that lane, because you can either turn or go straight, have to sit there and wait for them to make the turn. When the light is green and they, they, they have to sit there and wait. It's irritating. Mm. So, and, and I, like I said, I don't drive anymore, people, but there was a lot of things that used to... I had road rage. I, I had road rage. I hate traffic. I hate sitting in traffic. I have no patience for that at all. 
What about you? What do you hate? Uh, I have to agree with uh, Dougie's style. It, it, the, the most annoying thing to me is the right turners, who will not only slow down to an almost a stop in front of you, they'll actually pull all the way to the left in order to make a right turn. So, and making sure that absolutely nobody is going to be able to get around them. And it, it's one of the things that I'm so clear when I make a right turn, I pull to the right so people can actually get around me. Yeah. But I had the same problem in Walmart with people in their carts just parked in the middle of the aisles. And you just feel like, <laughs> wham, in their butts and getting them out of the way. Says, You're the only person in the freaking world. <laughs> We're not talking about shopping carts. We're talking about cars. It's traffic. It's still traffic. <laughs> Well, don't get in front of me in the supermarket! <laughs> you might get rammed. <laughs> anyway. Cart rage. <laughs> oh, and I hate it. Oh, this, this is even worse. This is even worse. When you are in traffic and people drive up the side of the... the, the um, shoulder. Shoulder to try and get in ahead of you. It's like, hey, we're all in the same boat. Get in line, buddy. I hate that. I used to pull my car halfway off the shoulder. I did that too. So people couldn't go. It's like, forget it. You're not getting past me, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Because that's dangerous here in California. They tend to shoot at you. Yeah. <laughs> and, um... Oh, what? Okay, my question for today is. Which, <laughs> you kind of forgot what you're doing? <laughs> yeah, I did. You got me going. You got me all riled up. <laughs> I got riled up. Uh, <laughs> Come on. My. Shh. <sighs> my question for today is. What? Is your favorite movies to watch? Like your favorite movie genre? Genre. Gen genre. What is your favorite movie genre to watch? And why? There you go. Okay. It's time for... Neighborhood Community. <laughs> she lost it again. Go on, finish. I want to get... Come on. Credit roll. I've got a really good one tonight. It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll. There and he's got go. a really good one tonight. So have fun, guys. Okay, so last night's question had to do with um, Pet Cemetery. Good, 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 good movie. Stephen King. Why are you doing that? It's not even about cats. You asked a question about cats. Oh yeah, I did ask a question about that. Yeah. Okay, the cat's name was Church. It was actually Winston Churchill is his name, and they called him Church. Yeah. And uh, how many cats played him? They had seven different cats. Each one of them had a, could do a different thing. Uh, each one of them could do a different thing. So uh, there was seven cats just to play one mangy little animal. So, and I gotta tell you, when I uh, started, we started babysitting for Nikki and John when they were next door, I had to go next door and feed the cats. I would always call um, Aphrodite Church. Because <laughs> she is the same, that blue haired, blue haired, uh, short, blue haired, whatever. So I, she, I kept calling them church. Okay, tonight's question. I am going to say a poem. Oh! This is Poetry Day. Is it a love poem? Oh yes, it's a love poem. Can you say it to me? Yes. As I was going up the stair, I met a man who wasn't there. He wasn't there again today. I wish, I wish he'd go away. So the question is, um, where did that poem come from? It, it actually shows up in two movies that I know of. It was in um, A Haunting in Connecticut 2009. And it was in an identity in 2003. Where did the poem come from? And what was it about? But I wouldn't want him to go away and tell me who he was and why he was there. But he's not there. But I wouldn't want him to go away and tell me who he was and why he was there. 
for this evening. You are all part of, <laughs> my brain is not working. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you out there. We would not be here if it weren't for all of you out there. We love you all very much. Thumbs up. Make sure to go by and check out all our other stuff. And we will see you all. Oh.